So, you may have noticed that even if you set the vertical alignment of a tag label to top, or bottom, the leader line is always at the center. That is due to the fact that the tag leader lines are always taken from the middle of the visible orthogonal bounding box of the tag, no matter what. One possible reason for that might be that unlike text notes, a tag might have several embedded labels, lines, text notes. So there has to be a standard for the leader attachment point. But let's say you have a standard one label tag, isn't it a bit harsh that you can't control the alignment for that at least? As always, there's a workaround. As we said earlier, the leader is always to the middle of the visible, leaderless portion of the tag. So, simply adding an element that is slightly above the label would do the trick. However, that element would be visible and we would have an unwanted result. So, we need to find a way where the software detects the added element as a visible one, but humans can't see it. First, we investigated a range of infrared and ultraviolet colors. That is still not a featured option in 2020. There's however a way to achieve that. First, a line should be drawn inside the tag family, that is slightly above the label. The distance for that line can only be determined by trial and error. Then, to hide that line in a way where we can't see it while it's detected as visible, we just set the line style to invisible. And there you go. Your tags now feature vertical alignment as well. You can now use Bird Tools Tag Alignment Tool to easily align them. Cheers.